Sci-fi has its unique way of boggling with our minds and leaving us awestruck when it comes down to space and the universe. Take for example, Star Wars, a sci-fi classic that made our childhood a bit more interesting. And in this episode, we would be looking into something that Star Wars came very close to getting right. What would happen if our Earth had two suns? If Tatooine is what comes into your mind, then the Force is with you. A planet that orbits two stars is called a circumbinary planet. You would easily bet a fortune that such planets are quite rare, but astronomers disagree. Almost 80% of the planets that astronomers have come across belong to a circumbinary solar system. As a matter of fact, a star system having only one star is quite rare. A theory also suggests our sun had a small hypothetical brother named Nemesis, which drifted off into the Milky Way and has since been lost. Although, what if Nemesis existed today and our solar system had two suns? Would we get toasted by the two suns? Would we ever have nights? What would happen? Well, things won't be the same anymore, that's for sure. As a fun fact, you definitely have two shadows. But unfortunately, for a lot of reasons, it won't be very same. The biggest problem being the existence of our planet. Yes, the planets that scientists have come across in circumbinary system are gas giants just like a big daddy Jupiter, but much bigger than him. Even the smallest we have come across is larger than Neptune. But let us not lose hope. The universe is massive and there are always anomalies. Optimism is of key importance and hence let us assume that a small rocky planet like Earth manages to exist in a binary star system. The next problem would be the orbit of our little home. In such a star system, our planet would have either of the two choices. Choice number one would be to revolve around both the stars. But this choice comes with certain consequences. If one of the stars is greater than the other one, then its gravity would obviously suck us into it. That means our rocky paradise would no longer exist and we would be roasted by the solar flares. On the contrary, there is another chance that both the stars won't be big enough and our planet's orbit would lie far away from the habitable zone. In such a scenario, our water wouldn't be able to stay in the liquid form and our planet would turn into a blob of ice. And we would probably freeze to death or starve to death and then be eaten by someone or something. Well, that's some scary stuff, but let's move on. Remember, our planet had one more choice. Choice number two, revolve around one star. This choice is not so great either because eventually a time would come when both sides of a planet would be facing the two suns. This means we won't have our nights and plus we would get double doses of UV radiation. Trust me, no sunscreen is going to save you from rays of that magnitude. Well, we all are clear that we don't want to get toasted or turn into an ice sculpture. But for that to happen, we need the orbit of a planet to be stable and lie in the habitable zone, which in fact is possible. The Earth's orbit could be stable if we replaced our sun with two closely matched stars, each half as bright as the sun. This would keep the planet within the habitable zone and it could sustain life. But this process would result into some major events. The total gravity of the two stars would be stronger compared to our single sun and thus it would take the Earth 280 days instead of 365 to take a whole circle around them. That means to complete a revolution. Fewer work hours and school days. Well, if I were you, I would definitely take this deal. We would also be able to witness something very interesting. The two stars would orbit each other once every 10 days and every 5 days, one star would pass in front of the other. From the Earth, that would look like a solar eclipse. But instead of a moon blocking the sun, it would be one star blocking another one and the show would last for about five hours. A grand show indeed. In such a scenario, the Earth would be just fine revolving around two stars and we'd be enjoying the dual sunset. But before we let you go, we have a small fun question for you to think about. Is 2020 a bigger threat to humanity? Or our old long lost sun, Nemesis, coming back into our solar system? Let us know about it in the comments and stay tuned for much more exciting videos.